Hi, I'm Kenny Shoulders, House Pro at Tempin Alley, Wilmington, North Carolina. Today we're going to talk about ball drilling techniques. What we do is, first of all, you want to take, you want to measure the person's hand, obviously, before you drill the bowling ball. And we've got a device that we use to do that. And with this, we measure the person's thumb, and then we measure the customer's fingers. And this particular customer decided he wants to use inserts, so we have to drill the ball to accommodate the insert. So that's really what we're measuring. We're measuring for his insert size. The second thing we want to do is we want to check the pitch on his finger and thumb holes. We'll bend the fingers back a little bit, and then we'll check to see how far they bend and how easy, how easy they'll accommodate the holes and what kind of pitch we need to put in the finger holes. Secondly, we want to check the pitch on his thumb because everybody's thumb is hinged differently to their hand. So what we want to do is... I'll have a customer grip my, grip my wrist like this, and whatever finger that his thumb points to will be the one that be the pitch that I decide that we want to use inside his uh, thumb hole. And that's important because we want to make sure we don't get any blisters on the thumb. We'll take that information, and we'll write it down on the, on the drill sheet, and then transpose it over on the bowling ball. We'll map it out on the ball, his grip, the pitches, and all that. Then we'll put the bowling ball in the drill press, and then we'll select the right drill bits, size, and then we'll drill the ball. And we can pitch it this way, pitch it forward, or pitch it reverse, depending on how his thumb is hinged. And then we'll go left pitch or right pitch, and that's the way we drill the bowling ball.